Welcome to Kaumudi Global. Sister Lucy Kalapura has strongly condemned this writer T. Patmanabhan's remarks, calling them extremely hurtful. This was not expected from a literary who is respected across the country. He, that is Patmanabhan, should render a public apology over the remark demanded Sister Lucy. At a gathering, Patmanabhan expressed their opinion that books written by women using profanity would be an instant hit. He claimed that if the author were a nun who wrote about her traumatic experiences at the monastery, sales would soar even further. Sister Lucy specifically objected to this statement. In the confessional autobiography she published under the title Kartavinda Damatil, that is, In the Name of God, she accused Bishop Franco Mulakil of sexually assaulting a nun at a convent a few years prior. She was expelled from the Franciscan Clarist Congregation in 2019 for demanding the arrest of the Jalandhar Bishop, who was on January 14, 2022, acquitted of all charges in the case by the Additional Sessions Court. Padmanabhan's remarks came while addressing a gathering after releasing the complete works of former judge and writer A.V. Govindan. He said, Nowadays in Kerala, you won't find takers for quality literary works. However, if a woman writes obscenity in Malayalam and other languages, it will sell numerous editions. It's lucrative for everyone involved. If the author is a nun writing about a tumultuous times at the monastery, the sales will go through the roof. He further said writers today are purposely choosing sensational content to ensure faster sales. If not vulgar or obscene, the book should at least be sensual in its content these days. In all my years of writing, never have I penned a single line that can be termed obscene or vulgar, he added. The writer took a dig at the trend of nuns writing books after revoking their vows. He said that they will still keep the designation sister for better sales. The writer pointed out that many such books describing on their bad experiences are coming out. Instantly, a section of netizens has been calling out his remarks, thereby quoting a controversy and Sister Lucy was the first to call out Padmanabhan from the famous personality strata. Meanwhile, the writer had also come down heavily on the trend of critics being silenced in today's India in June this year. Indians have lost their right to disagree, wrote T. Padmanabhan. Inaugurating a literary meet in connection with the state, Conference of the Kerala State Library Council in June, Padmanabhan said those who raise voices of dissent are being ruthlessly silenced in the country. Padmanabhan criticized the growing intolerance in the country as well. We tend to look at our neighbors with suspicion. If he does not share my beliefs, I hate him. If his clothes, way of living, worship and food do not agree with mine, he must go. We now live under a government comprising those who sincerely believe in this and work towards this goal. Stark darkness stares at us, said the short story writer. So if well-versed people like T. Padmanabhan comes to the fore by making such blatant misogynistic remarks by calling out women critics who write erotic novels and also female authors in general, won't it have a negative impact on our society? What do you guys think about it? Do comment below and let us know. I'm Neha signing out. If you like the video, please subscribe to our channel and hit the bell icon to get the latest updates.